Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Terra Tech, and I want to say that I think I've made the strongest vehicle in the world because there is just a graveyard of parts around me. If I turned around, you guys would see some of the craziest just clutters of parts that you would ever imagine. Look at this. We're blowing these little venture guys uh, to the moon and back. Oh man, mission complete. Oh, I'm excited about that. Did, did they drop anything on us? I think they just dropped us another little light. Nothing too special. Yeah, I just went ahead and I got uh, some more Megaton cannons. Uh, swapped out some of the little ones. What is this little thing? Let's see. Is this a radar? Yeah, it's the Venture radar. Uh, but yeah, swapped out some of the little stuff for some of the bigger stuff. And it's been working out pretty well. Uh, I got to say these Megaton cannons really kind of make it non issue like everything I've run across uh I basically if if I can line up my shot far enough away so you can see like you've got some range there and it's weird a lot of the AIs don't actually um register that you're nearby that close so once I uh, started you know getting everything and learning what I needed to do, it's it's worked out really, really well. Plus, with this huge repair bubble, I can always just drive past my stuff and repair it up if I need to. And then I just come over here and I get uh, these guys going and get all of my batteries recharged. It takes a, a hot second here to do that. But, uh, yeah, you can see I've got a couple of new parts on here as well. Quite a few batteries on this thing. I decided that, uh, you know, that was probably best to have a ton of batteries on it. Um, and I'm going to move these shield bubbles. I've been moving them out to the edges. And then in there, I want to throw in just a couple more batteries. Because batteries are what keep me out. Like, if, if I am out and about and I want to stay out and about... Having a ton of batteries is really where it's at. Um, I would love to get to level three of our grade three of the GeoCorp stuff. That way I could have um, their batteries, but I haven't actually ran into any yet. Um, I haven't. I haven't hit you know grade three of GeoCorp. Need about two thousand five hundred more uh, XP for them now one thing that i think i would like a lot is if you could turn off your repair bubble and turn it on when you needed it because if i could just have these shield generators running that would be pretty awesome blow these guys out of the water here and i mean these are just small fries not uh not really even that that important got that one blown away that one blown away i mean you can just see all clears enemies destroyed what did they give me? They gave me a radar that I already have. Okay. That works. I need to bring out my SCU and just start scooping up parts because I have so many out here. Like, it's, it is no joke, like a graveyard of parts in this area just because I've been blowing so much stuff up and just destroying stuff left and right and center. Uh, it's been pretty fun to do, actually. What is this little piece right here? Oh, that's one of those those guns. Okay. We're still at full battery power, too. Oh, I should have dropped off this payload terminal. You know what? Um, no, I'm going to put that back on. Uh, I found a payload terminal of Geocorp, so that's pretty cool. It's just, I guess it's just bigger. I don't really know what the, the major difference with it is. Um, but, yeah, I'm still going around just kind of destroying stuff and uh, trying to level up all of my different uh, factions. Well, let's see. Boom! You see that? How crazy is that? And they're just gone. Just gone. Incoming invasion? We'll, we'll take on an invasion. I ain't scared. I am not scared of you and your invasion. We'll wait 20 seconds. 18, 17, 16. La, 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 la. All right. Let's see here. Okay. Should be nine, eight, seven, six. All right. Just a few more seconds. Boom. Oh, wow. 
Base power. All right, that was exploded. Boom, exploded. So many parts through here. <gasps> what is that thing? Oh, I exploded it. Whatever it is. I'm going to take this girder with me. Thanks, man. Um, all right, he's got some more of those wheels. And these girders, I like these girders. They're, they're pretty nice, actually. Oh, here's a guy. Here's a guy right up here. Um, let's put that off the back. He's got these wheels, and I want to get four of these wheels or hit grade four or grade three with Geocorp. So I'm going to try my best not to destroy the wheels. There we go. There we go. It's got the big cab up there. Awesome. 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 All right. So we've got the good wheels. I'll put one on back there. I think this puts me up to about... I want to say about three wheels. Look at all these megaton cannons this guy has. Wow. Um, all right, let's let's roll back. I'll, uh, I really, I really, really need to go out on a little mission uh, with the SCU and get everything picked up. Just because of the amount of stuff that I have is just kind of getting ridiculous around here. Now with these wheels, I think I can put them on. I'd, I'd still only have three. So it still wouldn't be enough to have a, a full functioning vehicle. But I really, really, really want to use these wheels. Uh, I think they would be probably the best option for us. So yeah, let's get back over here. I'm going to drop some stuff here real quick. Get a quick battery charge in. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that. That payload terminal. Can drop that one as well. Okay, getting charged up nicely. Trying, to, I'm just constantly looking at this thing and trying to figure out if there's a way that I could be doing this better. Um, if there's something else that I could be doing with this particular design. Kind of wonder if these, all these little wheels and everything, are just not worth it. Let's check. Yeah, still only three of the big boy wheels. Okay. All right, let's roll out. I love I love these Geocorp wheels as well because the fact that we're raised so far off the ground, you know, we can basically roll over anything. All right, so there's this vehicle, and then there's another mission thing up just a little bit further. Bonaparte. I'm more like blown apart. <laughs> All right, those are good. Get those taken care of. And then there's another little guy over here. I hope this is Venture Corp. I don't think it is. I think it's another GSO. It is. And then what did we pick up? A old grade four. Okay, don't really know what that's good for. So we'll just kind of throw it on here. Um, all right. You know what? I don't, I don't really want it. <laughs> we'll come back for it later if we want it. Just kind of rolling around here. More stuff over this way. Look at that big vehicle off in the distance. That's Venture, I know. But it's not one that we have a mission for. But there is a mission up here. So we'll, we'll, we'll make a detour. Boom, boom, boom. Destruction all around. Got it. All right. And I think that's the majority of what drains our batteries is when I'm, like, driving through rubble and stuff. And I'm repairing the the their stuff, basically. Makes it a little tough. All right. Let's get around this garbaggio. Okay. Another base. Enemy hostile. We're good there. Got that destroyed. Got that guy done. Let's turn around here. Hehehe. <laughs> 
blew up towards me. That was funny. All right, there's another girder. There's this guy. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. So, I don't know. I really want to get this, this stuff leveled up because I want to start to get into some of the other uh, kind of accoutrements that are available to us. So I think I might take a minute and try and level up something, either Venture or Geo, and I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys, I've made a few modifications to the vehicle. As you can see there, look at this thing. This thing is a cannon on wheels, basically. Uh, at least 10 megaton cannons. There's 10 on either side, three in the front, so that's 13, 14. Uh, plus another four is 18. 18 megaton cannons. That is absolutely bonkers. Uh, let's go ahead and say mega. There we go. We got that. All right. Let's uh, fly off into the wild blue yonder. Uh, I've still been leveling up. As you can see, I'm in level two in both Geo and Venture Corp. Um, it's been kind of hard. I've been finding a lot of GSO. Uh, not so much in the way of venture or um, and they, they're dropping stuff. This is a venture delivery cannon. Can I like put that in there? No. Nope. Okay. Uh, anything that I don't think that I already have, I've been kind of putting in there. Um, I've got uh, hover parts on the bottom of the vehicle, and now I don't think they're actually doing anything. I think they're a little bit higher than uh, what would be necessary for something like that. Uh, so I don't, I don't think, like I said, I don't think they're really doing much. Um, let's see. There's all kinds of goodies out here. I mean, I've been just rolling over goodies and goodies and goodies uh, like you wouldn't believe. Turret. Let's take apart all of this because I really don't care. Let's attach that to the back. Uh, Multi-seeker AI. Throw all that up in the air. And then like this guy right over here. Let's check this out. Boom. Attacking him from the side, and he just doesn't even stand a chance. Multi-seeker is sideways. Let's put him on correct. That way it just keeps yelling at us. Or stops yelling at us. There we go. Now he's just backwards. Uh, lots of batteries on this thing. Um, and then, you know, we got the repair bubble and then the six shield bubbles. Um, it's It works out really, really well. I like this vehicle a lot. All right, let's see. Uh, we'll take out this area here. Base. Okay. Just kind of stand sideways. And it should take just about everything out over here. Oops, you were not supposed to destroy the base. Whoops. That's all right. I can deal with that. Kind of get all those guys. We already had GSO anyway. Um, let's see. There's something off this way. Now, I love these big wheels on this thing. I wish, I wish, I wish, I wish that uh, they were. it was just a little bit faster. But I guess it wouldn't be nearly as sturdy if uh, if that was the case. Let's see, this guy over here, this is going to be for Venture Corp. Get some shots off there. And it is out of here. Oh, wait, what? Why didn't it get destroyed? There's that little waypoint right there. Is this something? Do we need to destroy this? No? I don't really know. Where would it be? Maybe something... Maybe something glitched out with it. I don't know. But I've been rolling around a lot just trying to find uh, as many of these guys as I can. And then... Oh, look! One of these geothermal things! I'm actually going to throw that off. I don't really even want it. Um, let's see. Geysers... Okay, so let's throw on this geothermal thing, and then let's go down, and let's see 
How does this work? Wheel is overloaded. Is that doing anything? I don't see... Do you guys see how it's supposed to be working? Um, maybe it needs a different orientation. Let's see here. Trying to get it to where it's flat. Geothermal generator is not working the way that I thought it would. All right, let's, uh, oh, do, do I need to set it down over one of these things? Okay, and let's see, power, we already have all of those. Oh, I was hoping I'd have one of those, um, darn it, I don't have them. Let's see, do I have a payload terminal? I do. Let's throw that down, and then we'll throw down the power stuff. I can't get those, but I can get these, so let's grab a couple. And it's just not uh, not working. I wonder how that's supposed to happen. Player Tech 4. I'm just trying to get an idea here. And I don't see anything. Let's, let's take a look. Attach this generator to a thermal vent to generate free electricity. Look out for smaller rocks and destroy them to re reveal thermal vents. So if I put it on that one. And it just does not, uh, does not do anything. I wonder if this is not something that's all the way implemented yet. Because I know these little guys go to this. That's weird. All right. Well, I guess we're just going to head back to base. Nothing uh, Nothing I can really do. That's just kind of a bummer that, uh, that that's how that works. Um, let's see. Geothermal stuff. I mean, it, it sounded cool, but just was not to fruition. All right. Here's some venture guys up here. Enemy team ahead. Nice. Oh, you want to get messed up, huh? There you go. There you go. Oh, there's a couple down. Let's get this guy. Ooh, getting smashed. Nice. The crab. Let's get him. He should be easy enough. Actually want that piece. That's a charger. Let's back it up, back it in. Okay. Yep. Grab this. Definitely want the charger. All right. I think that's where we're gonna wrap up today, guys. I I know. I I keep uh, trying to get to this level three for each of these. And this vehicle that I've got here uh, is constantly evolving and getting better and better and better. Um, I'm, I'm digging it. I'm having a lot of fun with TerraTech. So if you guys too, uh, please let me know in the comment section down below. Um, and, uh, you know, do me a favor, hit that like button. It tells me even more so that you guys are enjoying the series. Uh, that's just a little venture thing. Okay. Um, and uh, leave me some suggestions of what kind of stuff you might like to see. And uh, I'll do my best to... Uh, commemorate. So, all right, guys, my name is Rex. Have a good one.